Hey y'all, welcome back to another edition of East with Fifi. Honey, we're gonna make this real quick, but I got to share this message. Never give up, okay? Never give up. Um, y'all, I was blessed today, okay? So let me tell y'all. Oh, let me show you what I got. I got chocharron. Big old fat piece of chocharron. This is fried pork belly, Mexican style. So got that, and yeah. what do you know? With the um, cilantro, say tripe. So, hmm. all up my teeth, but it's okay, cause guess what? Enrique's ate me today, y'all. Mm, something's gonna happen. So I ordered my menudo, the lady put my good old menudo into the um container and everything. And she told me to go ahead and go pay for it. So my little cute style, honey, we and whipped out the cards, right? Why come the card popped up and slid right behind the um where the food warmer thing is. These are big food warmers. And supposedly you can't move them. So, I stay calm. Got me super out. I stay calm. I said, man, my card and slid back there. So the ladies, you know what they tell me? They they fake look. I shouldn't say they fake look. They told me if it would have landed on, if it fell on that side, they'd have been able to get it. But they can't get it because you can't move those things. Okay. So, someone said, today's not the day, babe. We're not taking no for no answer. Not today. That's what I said in my mind. So, I said, can we call a manager? So they said they called the manager. I don't know if they called the manager or not. But yeah, didn't nobody show up. So I just turned around. I walked to the cab where the cashiers are because I know there's plenty of managers there over there by that cash. So I went over there. A young lady who's in the manager or lead position. I asked her if uh, she can call maintenance. Because at this point, I need a man okay, <laughs> to fix this. Okay. No. Mm-mm-mm. Hurry, right, y'all. Waste of time. Okay. So, made this man come over. A little older. Thick, older. So, he wasn't going to be able to uh, get his arm down there to get it. I didn't do much of anything. He was old. Too old and too weak to move what I need for him to move. So, um, you know, he's telling me if it was over here, he could get it. If it was over there, he can get it. Yada, yada, yada. Okay. Well, you can tell me it all you want to, but guess what? We're not giving up today. We're going to get what we need. We're going to get my bank card back, okay? Because the thought of me having to call my bank, cancel my card, go to the bank, ask for a new card, temporary card, and then wait in the mail to get that card when I travel back and forth from state to state was not feeling like it was going to be mentally feasible for me. Okay? Not today. So, I did what Fifi would do. I said, let's think about this. What do we need? We need a man. A viable man. I was going to say a real man, but we need a viable man. That can make this happen for Fifi. But you got to stay calm, girlfriend. So I stay calm. Got to be so proud. Um, the manager came over. Honey. He old and round, too. He can't do nothing. Well, the deli manager came over. He's a young, somewhat young, strapping young fella. And everybody told me, no, 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 no. Today was not a day for faith to be accepted, no. Now, when it came to my coin card, mm -mm. So, and Rick gave, he been right there. And well, he at least, one thing he did was he grabbed his phone, turned his light on. Can y'all see? No. Let's see. I said, but I know it fell back there. So, after that, he turned around. The last thing he wanted to do was move the little things, because they're probably at least a thousand pounds. The uh, food containers that have all the fried food and all that kind of stuff. He didn't want to move it, but he moved it. The first time he moved it about four inches, <clears throat> it didn't budge. I mean, it didn't. You couldn't see anything. Then he moved it again. I saw my card. 
guess what? My arm's too short. The maintenance man's arm's too short and wide. And the uh, manager, he had to get back because they would call him up front. Which I understand. I mean, he ain't got to sit around there. Well, let me tell you. We was about four to six inches too short. And Ricky, honey, he went and got uh, dismantled the, uh, dang, what is it called? He dismantled the paper towel roller, a uh, paper towel holder. Went and got some tape, baby. Let me, Enrique, <laughs> I love you. Honey, he just took that thing apart, took the pole portion of it, went back there, got some tape. The, um, you know, the tape that, uh, the food tape for the receipts that are for the food that when you mark a product, say this is Munudo, you put the Munudo on there. Honey, he got that and wrapped that around the end of that, uh, paper towel holder. Honey, that gave him the four to six inches he needed. Mm hmm To satisfy me, sleepy honey. He had took that and stuck it down there. That tape stuck to my credit card. And honey, he left my credit card up out of there. Baby, you can't tell me. Won't he do it? And Enrique did it. So, Fiesta. Y'all need to get him in a raise, baby. When I tell you ingenuity, he is very resourceful. He accommodates everybody's needs. This man needs a raise. Honey, he needs to be the manager of the store. Okay? Because, honey, he did that. Because all the other... Six employees told me, mm-mm, this thing don't move. Because even the manager told me that thing doesn't move. And I sat there and I looked at him. I said, so you're telling me, this is the manager. So you telling me this is a fixed object. He said, well, I don't, I don't, it's a one unit. I said, I understand this is a one unit, but is it affixed to the floor? He knew he couldn't tell me it was fixed to the floor because you have to move that and be able to clean it because this is a food service area, Okay. So, because I'm looking at, look at all this food, da 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 Ain't that messed up, fix there. And I understand, it, it's a, it was some work. But let me tell you, honey, we were okay. Hmm. We will be calling corporate, baby. Hunting <laughs> them, Enrico. <laughs> Enrique did feel you right, okay? And I'm, and I'm happy about it. I'll be coming to get my manudo every week for, uh, for my fiesta. Sure will. And my son used to work here when he was in high school. Um, all, everybody's new now, ain't the same employees, but. Yeah, baby, let me tell you something. Enrique, Fiesta. Enrique needs the rail. Promotion. All right, baby. Enrique needs it all, honey. Because he provides good customer service. He goes the extra mile. Listen. Enrique's a man. He's daily manager. I heard on Fiesta L on Loop 12 in Hampton. In Dallas, Texas. This Fiesta is Fiesta Mart number 65 at 2225 West Ledbetter. The phone number is 214-331-0270. Again, the number is 214-331-0270. So, you guys, if y'all want to call and tell the manager, I said thank you. If Fifi Star said thank you, please do, honey. Enrique! He's just a man, baby. Y'all. Y'all y'all know I don't let my want my videos to be too long. Don't forget to be blessed, stay blessed, and be a blessing to somebody else. Smile, wear your mask, and wash your ass. Till next time, y'all.